Marianne Cordero. Welcome. Uh, Thank you, Frederick. Yeah. So, so tell us about your plans, Marianne, for the foundation. So the foundation, um, as you know, it was uh, has the name of my father, my late father, Joseph Rufino Cordero. Uh, and his vision and mine are to promote and nurture talent in the fields of science, arts and sports. That in Hindi spells sas, or breath of life. Uh, we have three uh, golden projects at the moment which we are in the middle of working on. Uh, they all have some element of either sports or arts or science. So the first project is on divine literature. Uh, it is a translation of one of the most amazing holy Bibles called the Thomas Macklin Bible, uh, which was commissioned in 1800 by including uh, um, George III. Um, it was published by a woman, which is interesting. And it is going to be translated into Sanskrit. Uh, so why Sanskrit? because uh, it is the oldest language. And whilst most translations go from uh, English to, uh, from Sanskrit to English, in this case, it's the other way around. Uh, we've been uh, given the acknowledgement by the Pope, His Holiness the Pope as well. Um, and that is going to be, over the course of the next year, translated at the University of Benares, the Hindu University of Benares. Uh, the second project is the Golden Wing Scholarship, which is uh, in tribute to my father. It's a scholarship in aeronautics, and that was won by this year by Vivek Ajnagar-Gankar, uh, and he's going to be pursuing research and development in um, aeronautics. He's a young 30-year-old, one of the first people who worked on uh, J.D. Tata, uh, uh, mechanics. The plane that JG Tata flew? Yes, yes. Where is it now? I believe it's uh, in, in Mumbai. I see. Um, the last project is to do with uh, healthcare and um, recognizing healthcare is very important in, at the community level. And we're going to be uh, sponsoring a project called the Go and Nightingale Corps. Uh, which will be to, to educate young girls in nursing. Um, and we're going to try to work in association with Sanjivan, uh, the lady who was here. Asha uh, uh, Exactly, Dr. Asha. Yeah. Um, and the hope is that we will you know, expand that uh, and grow it into something much more nationwide um, afterwards. Tell us about your dad. Of course, I knew him, but uh, he was. Uh, I also read that he had actually set up the aeronautic, uh, the electronic systems in many airports. In oh yes, Singapore. yes. So the the book that I I, yeah. I gave to you uh, describes some of the projects that uh, were around the world. Um, a lot of them during his the height of his uh, career were in the Middle East, where oil exploration had given and oil exploitation had had made those countries wealthy. 60s, 70s? In the 70s, 70s, 70s and 80s, and in, Nis and in Indonesia as well. Uh, but he also worked in Africa and Malawi, um, and in his early career he worked for the Holkar of Indoor. Holkar of Indoor? Yes, yes. Electronics or aeronautics? It, no, he, he ran the airfield, I see. the aerodrome uh, of the Holkers. Uh, this is in the 40s, 30s? No, this would be in 50s, the 40s. 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 Late 40s, early 50s. I see. So he had strong connections with Saligao. Which oh, he always maintained his strong connections with Saligao because his mother built the house, our ancestral home, in 1936. Uh, and her family was from Mudavadi. Uh, my grandfather was also from Saligao, from Tabravado. I see. Thanks so much. All the very best. One last question. Your favorite photo in this book? My favorite photo, I think, would have to be uh, this one of my father at um, Ferguson College. I see. Uh, 1943? 1943, exactly. Ferguson College, Pune. 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 Yes. That time it was uh, also big. It was. It was indeed. And his other studies were in Matade Saligaon, this small village school? Initially. 
Yes, uh, but he also went uh, to school in Belgaum. St. Paul's? Uh, St. Paul's, exactly. And in the UK? And in the UK, he wasn't edu he wasn't educated in the UK, but he did his BSc at St. Xavier's College in Mumbai. Mumbai. So interesting. Thanks. Thanks and all the best. Thank you very much, Frederick.